justice is about rules concerning our rights and the process of distributing rewards and punishments. Two questions arise from the concept of justice. One, what is due to someone? Two, which principles are appropriate for which good? Justice is procedural, as in how to secure our freedoms. Since one could only survive and prosper in cooperation, we need a way to avoid conflict with others. That, according to Hume, requires rules that all would follow because they accept them as just. Justice is demonstrated by showing respect for the freedom and property of others. Procedural justice is concerned with respecting rules. It is about how decisions are made, not the fairness of the content. In a sports race, the result is fair if the rules are followed, such as everyone runs the same distance. The fact that the same runner wins every week is not proof of injustice. Justice is threatened from two directions. First, from judicial activism, decisions reflecting the preferences and prejudices of judges. Second, from the vague but superficial attractive principle of social justice, which is concerned with who has what rather than how they obtained it. Supporters of judicial activism believe that the role of judges is to do right. They measure decisions in terms of consequences rather than the method by which we arrive at them. This undermines trust and confidence and reduces the predictability of how courts will decide any conflicts. Competitive capitalist markets. Distribution is the result of a process of freedom and not created by the intentions of anyone. Justice applies to human conduct. Only human actions can be just or unjust. Thus, like Hayek, we should dismiss social justice as a mirage intentionally designed to mislead.